fear starts one way, but it just graduates in the person's mindset. There's a God that wants to set you free. We're on purpose. Are we letting fear uh, control us, or how can we overcome that fear that we may be faced with? I mean, fear is a, it's a topic that today you turn on the television or you watch anything, newspaper, whatever, you grab the, the for one of the first things that they out there to, to try uh, engraft in your spirit or, or impure in your spirit is fear. And, and this is what they call in the demonic world, we call that chip away. If I can chip away of your inner man, your mind, your soul, and your spirit, if I can chip away those areas of your life, I can control you, I can manipulate you, I can incarcerate you spiritually, whether the mind, the heart, or your soul. So that's the kind of witchcraft I would do, or that's the kind of stuff I would do with the enemy. Many times the church at large, we are really, we're in a place that we are actually not taking authority over fear or over tormenting fear over uh, every there's different stages of fear we're not taking over these uh demons these are demons see this ain't something that you know these ain't my senses uh, i feel goosebumps i don't feel well today now these are demonic forces at work and the church is not taking the authority that god has given us and the bible says in mark 16 says by these signs there were no Casting out these devils, casting out these infirmity devils, casting out these devils of worry, fear, anxiety, oppression, depression, because fear starts one way, but it just graduates in the person's uh, uh, mindset or the person's spirit or soul. It captivates you to a point that then now you are on medication. You're sitting on the psychiatrist's office or the psychologist's office telling your story. That's not who God, that's not God's perfect will for us because we have a purpose and a destiny as a church of Jesus Christ. Not only to bring the cross, not to bring the salvation, healing, deliver. We need deliverance in the church. We need people to know that there's a God that wants to set you free. Don't lose ground. Fight the good fight and get your victory and make Jesus Christ proud. Hello, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this video. To see more videos like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button below to get all of the latest content from TCT Ministries. We would love to pray alongside you for God's blessing in your life. So email your prayer requests to prayer at tct.tv or click the link below to submit your request at tct.tv. God bless you and we want to thank you for watching.